Hey everybody, Al here. So I've been playing with this new uh, Garmin Tactic 7 Pro with ballistics watch and I'm getting the hang of it real quick. I've only had it for one full day. So yesterday I went and uh, synced it with my rangefinders, both my binoculars and the Kilo 8. You have to have it set properly in the rangefinder and I believe it has to be set to external BDX external for it to pick up an outside device and that is what I have it on. So let me show you here how you sync them quickly. It, I did have to make a couple phone calls but uh, now it just picks it up real quick or it did the last time I tried it anyway. So from the main watch screen to you want to get to the applied ballistics um, in the menu so press and hold the menu button scroll down until you hit sensors and accessories okay now if you want to pair this for the first time you're going to hit add new so i'm going to hit or uh, hit add new i'm going to scroll all the way down or should have went up because it would have been quicker to apply ballistics Oops. now if i hit this it's going to search for my rangefinder and then i'm just going to turn it on by pressing that button and it'll find it so I'm going to back out of here, hit the back button, and here now I'm going to scroll up, and you can see that it says it's off, so <clears throat> I'm going to enter, and that's the 3000, so I don't want that one, so I'm going to scroll back out and scroll down, it's the second one I believe I want, so I'm going to hit enter, and it's status off, and that is the 8K, so once I hit this button, it's going to start searching, oh no, Oh, and look at that, it connected already, because I still had my rangefinder on. So, now I'm just going to back out of here. Now, if I press on Applied Ballistics, I am connected. So, let's go outside, and I'll do a couple ranges, and we'll see how it works. I'll just back out of here. There we go. Okay, see you outside. Okay, so here I am outside, so I'm gonna, they're paired still, connected, so let's uh, have a look. So to get in Applied Ballistics, I'm gonna hit uh, the back button once, twice, and there I am, and it, I don't know if you read that, but it says 1,094 right now. Let's range and see what happens. Okay, I got 1233 meters. If you look right there, it says 1233 meters. Uh, for my 338 Kdex, it's a 10.8 up and a 0.35 left for windage. And that's that's just spin drift and directions at nine o'clock for the wind. Okay, one thing I should note with this thing, you will know you're paired with the range finder because when you look inside, right to the left of the battery, there's a G. Now I'm guessing that's for Garmin and that will let you know that you are paired. You can also sc scroll down to the target card. So I'm going to press that and I go down to tar target card. So I'm going to go down to target. Press this now. I can scroll down to target 2 and I can range. I got 1,462 meters. Look, okay, if you look, target three, or two, is that 1,462 meters. Let's do one for target three. I already moved it down. 638 meters even. Target three, 638 meters. It gives you all your dope. And if I scroll back down, I can do target four. And say 90 meters. Target four is... 90 meters so now if I want to hit I'll just hit the back button and hit this button and I'm going to scroll up to target card hit enter and there's all my targets there all the, all the way down I can scroll up and down with the touch screen so it took me less than a day to figure this out it's fast I know I'll just get faster as I go I even let this sit for like 10 minutes and it was still connected. I actually uh, disconnect it each time. 
uh, when I put it away just so it's not searching and wasting my battery. So basically that's how you connect a rangefinder to the new uh, Garmin Tactic 7 Pro with probably. ballistics. Okay, it was probably a little hard to see outside. So just to show you the target card in that again, I'm gonna hit enter, enter. So there's uh, the applied ballistic screen. That's the last um, target that I ranged at 1233. So I'm gonna hit enter again, scroll down to target card, hit enter. Now here's all the targets. I don't know if you can see that, it might be tough, but like target one was 1233. That's the last target that I measured. Every time you measure a new target, it's gonna go into target one on the target card. You have to go down to the target uh, screen and then scroll up and down to each T1, T2, T3. So T2 was 1462, T3 was 638, and T4 was 90. So just to show you, like I say, I don't know if you can see that very good because it might be blurry, but uh, just thought I'd give you a better view here. I'll just hit the back button. So you have to scroll down to target and then uh, up and down range that'll give you a different uh, value range give you a different value and then when you're done just hit the back button hit this button again and then scroll up to target card and like that and that's how you read it if you're going to be shooting so uh just to back out of here there you go so basically that's how you pair your range finder with your watch it's still paired right now so i'm going to disconnect it so it's pretty easy to do, just press and hold again, like I said. And then I'm going to scroll down to sensors, press enter, and then scroll up because it's quicker. And you, can, and you can see that it's searching because it's not on. If I press this button, boom, connected, just like that. Did you see that? Okay, so I'm going to scroll back up, press enter, and now I'm going to shut this off by pressing enter again. So that's off. I'm going to hit the back button and you can see that they're both off and that's how I want to leave it when I'm not using it just so I'm not wasting um, battery life. So that's off, back, back. Still get a little mix up on the back button. There, and that's it. So basically that's how you connect a rangefinder to the new uh, Garmin Tactic 7 Pro with ballistics. Thanks everybody. Have a good day. So I'm at my daughter's house right now in Spokane, Washington, and she lives close to the airport. Let me show you. <laughs> There's an aircraft there coming in for a landing. Just a quick note, everybody. I just finished editing that video on how to connect a rangefinder to the applied ballistics algorithm. That's in the new uh, Garmin Tactic 7 Pro with ballistics watch. I'm gonna do a complete review on the whole applied ballistics app that's in the watch here soon so if this video helped you out please like and subscribe and hit that notifications button so you don't miss any of the future action and videos that uh, i'll be posting thanks everybody for watching and take care talk to you guys soon